now what we're going to be doing in here is tracking the photos. I'm going to be working with everybody individually in their Okay. Come forward a little more. Now feel how that slip slip and then goes? That's your traction tool turning itself back on. So that spot is what you're feeling for. When it starts to lightly spin once it goes, that's where you want to be. So that kicks in all the time. Okay, so come forward slow. You're going to go right up through here. Now just take your time and feel for that slip and spin. And you don't want to get too aggressive on the throttle because it'll cause you to spin. Now hold there. Straight wheel. Straight wheel. You turn hard to the right. You're just going to make it hard to throw. So straighten it out. Come back to the driver's side. Straight wheel. Right there, straight. Now, keep it right like that and try driving forward. Now, let the vehicle talk to you and tell you how much it needs for traction. Now, lightly increase. Feel how that traction control kicks in? That's what you want to do. Just keep feathering like that. Let it kick in. Yep, just like that. Easy. Go straight. Just nice and easy. Keep working that. A little bit more. Okay, now make it work right. Okay, hold there. Put this down a sec. Now, did you feel how it kicked in there? It's, it'll slip, slip, and then all of a sudden it locks and goes. That's your traction control turning on. So now you're really going to feel it here. So come forward slow. Just keep the wheel straight. And it's going to slide around. Let it do that. Turn the wheel. Now, lightly increase. There it is. You have to hit that sweet spot for it to turn on. If you're going too slow or too fast, it won't turn on. Now, increase. Now, it kicks in right here. Now, just let it slide around a little bit. What it's doing is cycling between all four tires to determine where it needs traction. See how that does that? Yep. Keep working it. Nice and easy. Basically, what happens here is called brake on the front. You'll get the front one tire to rear spinning. It won't kick in. If you're too light on the throttle, it won't kick in. Delicate balance in the middle. Okay, so now come forward a little bit more. Feel it right there, it kicked in. And you're, on yours, you're going to see the light start to blink right here. So just keep the wheel straight and go forward very slow. Don't turn the wheel. Right there. Now, nice and easy. Right here is going to start to spin. Feel how it starts to kick and go. Stay with it. Feel how it pulls you through. Slip, slip, and then it goes. There's your traction control again. What you're feeling for is going to go slip, 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 and then it's going to take off. Feel that? Okay, turn this way. Right there. Nice and easy. Now, same thing. Okay, now with your, oops, just slightly touch your step in the dirt. Now, hold there a second. Stop there a second. Now, with yours with the manual, it's going to take a little bit more finesse for you. <laughs> but basically, it's all right. It's, well, with the manual, I always tell everybody, slow down and go small increments. You only have to go, focus on going a foot or two, pause. A foot or two, pause. That's the easiest way with the man. It slows it all down. And don't worry about anybody else. You have all day to get through here. So now, as you go forward, most people with the manual, they, they let the clutch out so far and then mash the throttle. You don't want to do that. You just got to keep it from stalling. So here, you let the clutch out until it starts to grab. So hold there. Now, right foot on the brake, left foot on the clutch. Now, let the clutch out slowly without letting off the brake. One more. Right there. Feel how it grabs? That's what you're feeling for. So let it grab again. Right there. Now lightly let it go break and slowly go forward. But you can leave the clutch there. You're not hurting it. So let it come out and grab. Yeah. Now lightly give it a little gas. Feel how it's starting to crawl? Now right here, lightly increase. Right there's your traction. Feel how it slips, slips, and then goes. That's your traction. Just keep feathering that and embracing that. That's the sweet spot you got to do. Did you get that sweet spot? Okay, so now what you're going to do is as you come forward, you feel it start to spin. You want to let it spin for a second, then very lightly increase the throttle. So turn a little bit toward this side, toward me, right there. I like that. Just crawl forward slowly. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Yeah, easy. Now go to the driver's side and just let it work. 
the passenger side a little bit, right there. Let it work. You see how all four kick in like that? Okay, turn towards me. Keep it turned towards me. Keep going forward slow. And hold right there. Okay, hold there, hold there. Now, let this do the work. So if it starts to spin, don't mash the throttle. Just let it do the work. So now turn this way slightly, right there. Now start to go forward ever so slow. Let it spin. Now right there, don't let it spin. Now let it increase. Oh, you're gonna feel it kick in. Let it increase. And there's your traction control. You know how it slips and then goes? Yes. That's your traction control. You get tired of looking. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be editing these photos and I'll be seeing that <laughs> 1,500 times. <laughs> <laughs>